So why are we in Richmond, Paul? It is the location where Ted Lasso was filmed. Ted Lasso? So why are we in Richmond today, Paul? It's the location where Ted Lasso is based. What is Ted Lasso about? Ted Lasso is a fictitious character. He was an American football coach hired by Rebecca Welton to be the head coach of AFC Richmond. He moved from Wichita, Kansas to London and had to acclimate to life in a foreign country. Now let's take a look at some of the places featured on Ted Lasso. AFC Richmond is a fictional club and is partly based on Crystal Palace FC. We have been to Richmond Green before, so what is the significance of Ted Lasso? Ted Lasso lived in close proximity to Richmond Green and it was also featured very heavily on the show. Many various characters of Ted Lasso were seen walking along the screen. They may have also seen a cricket match or two. But they always seem to be playing cricket here. But I think they're having their tea break now, or maybe it's lunch, because it's one of those sports where they have to keep stopping to oh. eat. And that's a sport that I would really <laughs> enjoy, I think. Did you often hear aircraft on the show? Because we're right on the flight path to Heathrow Airport here. No, I haven't, but I do notice it above. Well, maybe they blurted it out. They were able to mask it in some way. So what is it about Ted Lasso or Lasso <laughs> that you liked? I think it wasn't about the football because I don't really watch football. I think it was about the foreigner moving from the US to London in Richmond and I think it was about him adjusting to life here and the trials and tribulations. I think it was a bit funny and a bit quirky and there was a lot of humor and seriousness to it. It was kind of like a, a dramedy so it was a good um, a mixture of the two and I do like the acting by Jason Sudeikis and Hannah Waddingham. So did you see a bit of yourself in him? Because when you moved to the US, to London or to the UK, um, you lived in Kew Gardens, which is just like Not one stop far. away from here. <laughs> mm. Or Chiswick, really, I suppose. Yeah, it was maybe some similarities. So I think that that's what I gravitated towards. So why are we at Richmond Riverside? I remember various scenes with Roy Kent and Keely Jones walking along the river. Ted Lasso's address on the TV show is nine and a half paved court. The actual address is 11A. Ted Lasso would have discussions with Coach Beard outside his flat. This is the street that is featured heavily outside Ted Lasso's flat. I remember the and I remember the phone boxes in the background. 
Oh, have you actually found them, Paul? Yeah, I think we found a carbon cutout. Oh, right, a cardboard cutout. Did you say carbon? <laughs> <laughs> so this is Jason Sudeikis? Yeah. Do you think this is the actual house then? Or is it just someone cashing in on it? I think someone cashing in. No, so I think it was like around here because it was between 9 and 11. So this is the sign that they had on the show. That's sign for what? To believe against adversity. Oh. Yeah, so I think this is all part of the show. Okay. And right here, this is the house, 11A. Mm. But you said it was number nine I, on the show. I think it was nine and a half. Nine and a half. Yeah, but I think this is it. The 11A is the actual. So what's it like actually walking along paved court? I think I have walked along this paved court before, but not since watching the TV show. So it had no significance previously, is that what you're saying? Yeah, I think I might have done it once, but I didn't really realize all the... Do you know what? Why stuff? don't you ring the doorbell and see if he's in? The Fuller's Pub, The Prince's Head, was featured heavily in most of the episodes. Only exterior shots of the pub are used and scenes inside were filmed elsewhere. <laughs> it's no illusion. You're watching It's Paul and Marcus on YouTube. So please subscribe. watching our YouTube channel today. For those of you that have liked our channel, please hit the thumbs up. For those of you that haven't subscribed already, please hit the subscribe button and we do also appreciate your comments and we will see you next time. Oh, and before I go, for those of you that are feeling very generous, we would also appreciate a nice cup of coffee. So thank you very much.